So, thank you guys for coming out. Just so you know, this wasn't for me to speak into, because there's only you know, 10 of you. Uh, this is for the jazz portion, uh, for the solos, so they can be heard over the ensemble. So just a quick couple things about this. So we used to, in fact, I think the last time we had a summer music camp, Mr. Markov was in it. As, as, as a student, like a little student too. Uh, it used to be something that we did every summer, and we would have a jazz portion and a concert band portion. Um, because of the, uh, uh, actually it was Dr. Falco who reached out and asked if we would do one. So uh, we're very appreciative of Dr. Falco for this idea. Um, it's been a lot of fun. Uh, one of the things that we have always talked about as directors is one of the best things for a program is when kids keep playing over the summer. Obviously, this gave us a wonderful opportunity to get these kids playing, but more importantly, to give them a couple of new experiences. So we're going to start with concert band today. Uh, the music we're playing is a little bit, I would say, more advanced than the age of some of these kids. And yet, in five days, they've made huge strides on these three pieces that we're going to be playing for. And then we're actually going to switch to a, like, something that we've never done before. We wanted to give some students the opportunity to play chamber music. Chamber music meaning a small ensemble of students. But because, as you can see, of how uh, different instrumentation that we have, we decided to do something a little bit outside of the box and we uh, started a percussion ensemble. So as I'm sure some of you have heard, either from you know excitement or dread, uh, many of these students that have never played percussion are actually going to be in a percussion ensemble after the concert band portion. And then all the brass players we forced into doing jazz. Uh, brass and our saxophone player. So it's, it's kind of a different thing that, like I said, that we wanted to try. We're going to start with concert band with Mr. Marcotte as our conductor.
panic that I'll mess up anymore. Um, I'll conduct the last piece called Abandoned Treasure. Like idea where they just come into jazz band and they play notes 
in a not really particular order, and that's going to make a really big really jazz soul, and that's not always the case. So we took this opportunity this week to show these kids not only some like really standard jazz tunes, but also to give them the opportunity to work on improvising on their own. We had like a step-by-step -step process that we went through, teaching them like the very fundamentals of what they needed to do, and then just kind of expound on there, experiment with different ideas, learn how to implement those ideas. It was a really fun week, um, and I saw a tremendous amount of growth. Every kid, every kid in here solo, almost every one of them is is bold enough to solo for you today, which is which I'm really proud of too. So, uh, looks like Mr. Shaker is ready to play the bass for us. And I think here for the upset. So, our first chart for you today is called Blue Monk by Thelonious Monk, and it's going to feature Caleb Bieber on trumpet, Jacob Peterson on tenor sax, and Morgan Clifford on alto sax.
Uh, it's going to feature Lucas Minocco on trumpet, Logan Circus on trumpet, Liam Hagen on trumpet, notice the trumpet, and Brendan Folster on trumpet, just to make things easier. spend this week with your, your kids. You got uh, really, really, you guys raised some awesome kids. It was really cool getting to know them on like a little bit more of a personal level this week. Um, it was more laid back in the school year, obviously, and we made some really great connections, and I'm sure that you saw that that show today in the music. So thanks once again for having them out here, and we hope to do this next year. If that's a possibility, we hope they're back and they're their friends too. Anything to add? Awesome. Thank you. Have a great rest of your day.